so as soon as the movie starts, we are told that Godzilla and Kong had a big fight about five years ago where Godzilla went into the depths of the sea to defeat Kong, and just after that day Godzilla got some couldn't even find out. No one has seen it, and then we are shown a scene after five years where we see an island. Which was actually Kaun's house and here we see that Kaun's size has now become much bigger than before. After this we wake up after sleeping and enjoy a lot in the water. There we see a little girl who. We used to like it very much. Both of them were also very good friends and Congress did not bother about the child. Used to believe all his words. But this girl can neither speak nor listen and here we find her very aggressive. Who is very angry and he throws one towards the sky which breaks the energy wall. And it is here that we learn who was actually put under this town so that Godzilla would not be there again. Go because these two titans can fail each other, then fight again. Because Kong was already a lot bigger. The size is decided because it will be shifted from here to somewhere else. After this we are shown a boy who used to work for a company, and he was also basically a hacker and in which company he used to work. She used to make many modern things like machines, robots. But that hacker has a little doubt on his company that the company is making something which should not be made. That's why he hacks all the data of the company, so that he comes to know that this company is a very big company. Hong Kong is shifting. But then the alarm starts ringing there, and it was the arrival of Godzilla. In no time, Godzilla comes out of the ocean. As soon as he comes out, he starts destroying everything. No one could understand why Godzilla is killing everyone. Because what kind of titan is he who saves humans, saves their lives? Here we come to know that Godzilla has a power, and that power is nuclear power, and Godzilla destroys the entire company using his nuclear power. After this the news goes viral all over the world that Godzilla has arrived, but this time he... Change has come. He is not the same as before, i.e. earlier he used to save humans, but now he is grassome and is killing everyone in anger. The owner of the company is telling everyone in the news that our company is working on a project. Very soon they will be able to make such a device which can compete with Godzilla. This news is also seen by a girl whose name is Medicine. But here Medicine does not agree that Godzilla has come in her because she knew Godzilla very well. That's why she considers this news as just a nonsense because she believed that Godzilla can never harm anyone but he. Helps the farmers. His John saves. Medicine goes to her father and tries to explain to him that Godzilla could never do this, and something must have been done to him. But Medicine's father tries to explain to him that look son, all these creators are all Titans humans. Are like that means their mood can change. Now see Godzilla has also changed and he is killing humans. After this Medicine leaves from there, and she listens to the online audio of that hacker. The hacker actually uploads an online audio about Godzilla. Medicine here. She says that she will meet the Jagros hacker and will go and ask him about the last affair. Why is Godzilla gone from home, and why did he destroy that company? After this, the owner of the company goes and meets Nathan, a senior doctor. Dr. Nathan is actually a scientist too. The owner of the company tells Dr. Nathan that your concept, Hall North, was perfect and that this is the place where Titans are born. Actually, Dr. Nathan had written a book in which he had written that there is another land inside the land whose name is hollow meaning that it is hidden and no one can see it. No, I mean the earth is the source of the titan's energy. On the other hand, the owner of the company, the doctor introduces the three to another man as well. The owner of the company, the doctor, tells the three that they have found a source of energy inside the woman in the hall. Now here, we do not know that at all. Where does the hole over exit? It was hole over. Actually it is under our land and the way we take energy from Surat and get the beans in the same way. There is an energy source in the earth from which all these titans take energy, and if these people are able to find that energy source then they will be able to compete with Godzilla. Doctor asks Nathan that how will we reach that whole low earth? Because now a few years back my brother also tried to go there but he could not go there and died. Here we know that there is no gravity in hollow earth. That's why there everything starts flying in the air. On which the owner of the company tells Dr. Nidin that you don't have to worry about it because our company has made an anti-gravity car with the help of which we can get there. We'll go to the meaning. The owner of the company. It also states that each of the titans has one. There's a reversal that helps each of the titans find their way home. That's why whose help should we take? 
After this, Dr. Nathan meets a friend of his who was also a doctor, and this female used to take care of Dr. Who. Dr. Nathan tries to explain to the female doctor that we should send Count to his home, and he should be home because we can't keep him here for long and even if he gets out of here, Godzilla will kill him. Will attack. That is why one can remain safe only in the foul earth. Now after a little debate, finally that female doctor also gets ready for this because apart from this she has. So there was no option. Then these people along with their entire army start taking them towards the all over. Whom were these people taking away tied up peacefully? Kong's friend? That is, she talks to the little girl in gestures. The girl tells who is angry because he is tied with chains. The army leader tells the female doctor that we will not go through Godzilla's way, and we will go through some other way so that the court district doesn't get to know. On which the female doctor says that yes, of course we should do the same because Godzilla and Kaun have a very old enmity because both of them consider themselves the king of monsters and if they both. If they come in front, they will create havoc. We then see Medicine taking her friend to meet the hacker. Here he tells them that actually the company is making a very big thing and that thing will be shifted to Hong Kong. But Godzilla didn't like this. That's why he attacked that company and destroyed it. Then we see in which ship the alarm has started ringing. That child is telling the female doctor that Godzilla is coming. Dr. Nathan says that now that Godzilla is coming out, we should set anyone free, that is, we should unchain him. The rest save us all by fighting Godzilla and now finally Godzilla comes out who is moving forward while destroying his ship. From those people you get to know that Godzilla is coming so he starts shouting loudly but he was tied with two chains. Then these people attack Godzilla with rockets and missiles, which have no effect on Godzilla. Godzilla destroys the planes of those people and now Godzilla was moving towards the ship with Kong. Godzilla destroys all of their ships and here Godzilla overturns their ship which causes Gong and the others to sink into the temple. Then, let's open people's lockers to see who can save them all by fighting Godzilla. Then Godzilla and who is great for whom throws Godzilla deep into the ocean. Then he straightens the overturned ship so that everyone's lives can be saved. But Godzilla flies once again and he was going towards the ship in which she was a child and here who jumps from one ship to another and finally reaches the ship where Godzilla was coming. Who here kills Godzilla with one mighty punch. While fighting back, Godzilla also hits Kong, causing Ko to fall down. Kong. Once again he gets up and kills Godzilla and Godzilla goes and falls into the sea. This makes Godzilla very angry and here he uses his power i.e. nuclear power. Seeing this, Ko quickly jumps into the water to save his life. The light of Godzilla's nuclear power spreads everywhere. Everyone is quite surprised to see him, and here we get an idea of how powerful Godzilla is. A fight starts between them inside the sea itself. Godzilla could breathe in water but was like humans. That's why he couldn't breathe in water. Mung was seen losing. He is taking Godzilla to the depths of the same ocean to kill them. The female doctor says that we should help Kaun as soon as possible, or else Godzilla will kill her. Then they blast many missiles in that temple, due to which it happens that who comes out to save his life. The doctor gives three orders to turn everything off. Shut down all the engines and machines so that Godzilla understands that we are defeated and dead, and then these people shut down everything, then Godzilla looks at them angrily, and then leaves. Female doctor says that if we, if we move forward Godzilla will feel us again and attack us. So how do we proceed now and who do we take on? On which the doctor says three that whom will we fly away and take away. On the other hand, we see that medicine has entered into that company with her friends. To check which is the last company making things, Godzilla got angry and attacked. There those people also get the eggs of a very big animal, and then as soon as those people get the eggs their door gets locked. In fact, where these people go, there is a machine which was taking these people along with the eggs very fast to Hong Kong. Then we see that. Through blank copy terms, the entire army succeeds in reaching Koli. They tell people to go to the cave with all over but they refuse to go there. Then these people decide that they will tell the through of that girl that she should go there because the congress did not bother about the girl. Along with that, who will also be told that your family is also there? There are other creatures like you over there and over here eager to go into that and over here into that hall and who do these people follow with the help of their anti-gravity car hollow? 
Women are of a different kind. Was. Now because they had anti-gravity cars that's why their lives are saved and there were different types of monsters in Hello Earth. Just then a flying monster attacks their anti-gravity car. That monster is about to attack that girl too but Congress catches the monster and kills it and later beheads the monster itself. After this we start moving fast leaving everyone else behind them. Now, due to the absence of gravity on the hollow earth, all the stones there are flying in the air. And his friends reach Hong Kong and here they come to know about the secret weapon of that company. To kill Godzilla, this company has created another Godzilla and the name of this new Godzilla is Mega Godzilla and in this, the man controlling Godzilla is the one whom the owner of that company had introduced to Dr. Nathan. A skill crawler is left there to check Godzilla's powers. Mega Godzilla uses his power to kill Skullcrawler here but there is a glitch and that is that he needed more power to run Mega Godzilla. She was just an only in Follow Earth and that was the reason why the owner of the company was looking for that energy source that over there so that he could revive Godzilla again. After this we see that Godzilla has been activated. As soon as Mega Godzilla is worried, Godzilla feels him and that is why he starts moving towards Hong Kong where Mega Godzilla was. Gola was very beautiful to look at and the energy source in whole low earth was in a mountain. Congress goes towards the mountain and opens its door and beats loudly. People find a Viapan over there which was an X and this X is not a normal X but it is made from Godzilla's body which is very powerful. Takes and sits at one place. Just like King Godzilla who had reached Hong Kong and now he was heading towards Mega Godzilla causing everyone to run here and there to save their lives. On the other side, the energy source is also found and here he also comes to know that the energy source can also charge his X because his X can run only after being charged and after being charged, it becomes more powerful. She goes. Godzilla doesn't care. It is known that someone has come to Holy Earth, through which Godzilla hits his nuclear power on the ground due to which that nuclear power reaches to whom by tearing the ground? A female honor of the company treats them. She sends a small sample of this energy to her company so that they can activate Mega Godzilla. Although the female doctor forbids her to do so, she does not listen to her. That girl realizes that Godzilla is also going to come here, so she starts running from there, but then Ko catches her car and destroys it. Kong gets ready to fight Godzilla by taking his axe, as he was given a hint to fight him to get gold through this nuclear power. Then Kong escapes from there and goes to Hong Kong. Tum attacks Godzilla but B mistakes his axe as he gets trapped in the building and takes advantage of the opportunity to knock Godzilla down, and a fierce fight ensues between the two. Godzilla tries several times to kill someone using his nuclear power but bravely fights back and survives each time. Then Kong attacks Godzilla with his act and injures him, which angers Godzilla and he uses his nuclear power to throw Ko Hong away. But Kong uses his axe to turn that power. Prevents you from leaving. The fight between these two goes on for a long time. Now because Godzilla was very powerful that's why he was seen doing it. After injuring Godzilla, he throws him there and starts throbbing loudly by stepping on his just. Seeing that, whoever starts beating loudly and then Godzilla starts leaving leaving Kong. We see that the owner of the company had found the energy source through which he could wake up Godzilla. Here we come to know that main Godzilla is much more powerful than Godzilla and is also much bigger in the same size. But here Mega Godzilla takes everything under his control. That's why. Drenched Godzilla first kills the owner of the company and later kills his assistant as well. Then Mega Godzilla comes out tearing down the wall. When Godzilla sees I Godzilla, he proceeds to fight him, and there is quite a fight between the two of them. Now because I Godzilla was very powerful that's why Godzilla was seen losing. Godzilla hits Godzilla hard and knocks him down. Medic and the hacker Mega try to turn off Godzilla's powers but all the machines there are activated. On the other hand, we are shown Kong who was heavily injured due to fighting and his condition was very bad and he was almost going to die. When the girl listens to her heartbeat, she tells everyone that Kong's heartbeat is slowly decreasing. On which the doctor says that to save Kaun, we have to give him a very big electric shock and these people give Kaun a hobby with the same anti-gravity car, which gives him a big shock and he gets up again. Is. 
That child tells us in gestures that look, Godzilla is not our enemy, he is our friend, so go and help him, then we go to save Godzilla. Nigga. And Zilla is just about to kill Godzilla by using his nuclear power when Kanga goes there and saves Godzilla here. Godzilla immediately knows who and who I should fight together. But I Godzilla was so powerful that it was overpowering both of them. Who can see his ex? But the trouble is that it doesn't charge but who still attacks that Godzilla? But I kill Godzilla and who is he about to kill then who stops him from doing so? Because the machine like medicine and that hacker was not stopping, so that the powers of Mega Godzilla could be reduced. That's why he gets angry and pours water on that machine, due to which Mega Godzilla gets off for a while and taking advantage of this, Godzilla charges the Cusex with his nuclear power, and now who has the cover? Was? That's why he leaves Godzilla devastated. Breaks his hands and legs and separates all his body parts, and in the last he throws the winter of Mega Godzilla. Now that Godzilla was dead, everything returns to normal. But then Godzilla gets up again and Joe takes his axe ready to fight Godzilla. Now because both of them had helped each other, that's why they do not fight. The ocean also goes away from where it came and when Kong has gone to Earth forever and Kong has taken the little girl there with him and that's where the movie ends.